300 fucking pounds that I can't open the Taco Bell bag. going on everybody the big guy Ryback here with Ryback has heat and today I am doing the Taco Bell Reaper Ranch tortilla chips it's a fairly large bag here a uh, good sized bag uh, it, it's heavy that's what she said <laughs> it says uh, looks can be deceiving double that's what she said um this chip may look tame, but we took the epic hotness of the Carolina Reaper pepper and paired it with the cooling zest of ranch for a flavor you could feel. I uh, I just ate. I got a 24-hour fast coming up, so I'm knocking these out. Not actually. This is. I'm not doing a cheat meal here. I'm really been going hard with the training and just don't feel like eating one today. I want to really let that 24-hour fast uh, hit. But this, I hope to God these don't mess me up because those Reapers. It's Taco Bell, so I'm assuming, I, I don't know. I, I imagine they wouldn't make a bag to, to completely screw everybody up, but I just ate a big meal, uh, my post-workout meal. So uh, there's uh, eight grams of fat. There's three servings in this thing, so 24 grams of fat, 15, 30, 45, 47, 49, 51 grams of carbs, and uh, six grams of protein in this uh, new Reaper Ranch tortilla chips. Guys, we're going to get right into it. I got my finish at BCAAs. And uh, a little bit of ice in it. I don't know really. Uh, this is going to be kind of a. I don't know how hot these are going to be. Carolina Reapers are obviously they're they're hot. We know that much, right? And uh, we'll do a review of these uh, Reaper Ranch things, guys. Too for anybody you guys want me to do any try anything, any food challenges or any you got games. We got some cool stupid stuff coming here that we're going to be doing. For one, uh, what's that smell party game? I think I'm going to wait for Phoenix for this one. Maybe try to get Phoenix and Jaden Cole uh, for a drinking um, little game of what's that smell. Tell me what you think of that in the comment section. I'm not playing this by myself, guys. Don't worry. And uh, I got a cool little thing, this balance thing. Uh, I'm going to do a video of that uh, that's being sent. And so if you guys want to send anything and you think it's a cool uh, P.O. Box 752740, Las Vegas, Nevada, 89036. I'm making sure that's the correct one, 89036, correct. Yeah, and address it to, to Ryback Reeves or to Feed Me More LLC. Guys, I know that, and uh, we'll get it, and we'll do some videos and whatnot. Uh, and I say and whatnot a lot. That's my, like, thing. But hey, we're going to get into this, guys. We're going to, I don't know... Three hundred fucking pounds that I can't open the Taco Bell bag. <laughs> uh, I tried, I tried, I tried very smoothly not to struggle. I didn't get a good grip on it. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, there we go. I got it. Somebody in there's there, there's somebody having a field day right now between that damn condiment pack. I couldn't open this Taco Bell chips, guys. I just did a huge workout. I'm exhausted. There's no excuse. I just I couldn't get. It. But I got it, so <laughs> suck it. Uh, they smell actually good. They don't smell like they're too dangerous, which scares me. UK Chili Queen's messaging me again. We talk all the time because we talk about chilies. I told her I was doing a video. Her and Johnny Scoville are my uh, chili head, uh, chili head experts. My chili head coaches. I'll keep the bag this way. Somebody wants to look at the front of the damn bag while I'm doing the video. Let's just get into it. Uh, four minutes for you fucking idiots that are upset at what time it starts. We're getting my tolerance ready for that Mad Dog Plutonium number nine. I'm really pissed off the Bell Life guys, really. Do that challenge my way. They're going to fuck up my whole day. They knew that, too. They knew that. Fair play to them. 
I'm thinking of starting to really get them back after I do that. I gotta issue another challenge. Mm. These are not vegan, they do have milk and cheese. I just not eating animal protein, animal meats right now. I weighed 301 pounds going to bed last night and I've gotten leaner and more mus my muscle density has improved in the last two weeks, as well as my conditioning. And I think I've gotten better looking too. All that meat, the mountains I was eating, stressing my body. I mean, look at my face. I look fucking, like I'm fucking 24 right now. Mm. So I got to say, I think I have a little bit of kick to them, but it is what I expected. I feel like Taco Bell maybe just snipped the tip of the Carolina Reaper pepper off per bag and like just barely got any Reaper on any of the chips. Mm. My tolerance though has gone up a lot. These are really good. This isn't a little bitch channel, like I said, guys. We do a review. Sit down with me. Get a beverage. Put do some popcorn. Whatever it is that you want. Enjoy the video with me. Get your own bag. Just two people watching each other on YouTube eat. Mm. How do your chips taste? Mine are fucking amazing. This video will be out after New Year's. Happy New Year's, everybody. I'm still trying to figure out what I'm gonna do, if I'm gonna do anything. It's kind of tough with Sophie. I should throw a party here, though. That'd be fucking dope. I have a great party house. It's big. As you eat these, they do get a little hotter. And I do just want to say, oh, I gleek. I understand that some people don't understand that I'm eating in my home, so I'm not really concerned about eating in front of a large audience because in my head, I'm just eating at home in the comfort of my own home. But I am an understanding individual. And if you are offended by the way that I eat or how I conduct myself, you can go fuck yourself. They got the reaper peppers right there. So many chips. Done. delicious all right guys
Um, I do want to say the chips were absolutely amazing. They said that it's a scorching uh, spice level. They have uh, five Carolina Reapers there. Uh, compared to the things I've done, like that last one that you guys saw, that Mad Dog 357 Chocolate Bootla uh, Ghost Pepper Hybrid. That was a Chocolate Bootla Ghost Pepper Hybrid. Dry, dehydrated pepper, guys. That thing, to give you guys an update on that, so I die because I digest this stuff. I don't throw this stuff up, guys. You'll have a lot of people that'll do the hot stuff that go throw up after. Now, again, like Johnny Scoville, if you're doing that whole thing or like the Mad Dog Plutonium, you have to. <clears throat> but I do believe if you just build your tolerance up slowly, you internally can actually get much better. Your body recognizes the heat, and that's what's happened with me. Um, because like I said, that tube of terror, those peanuts were the, the most that, that I ate those on an empty stomach in the hot tub was going for a home run and uh, heat wise, it was the hottest. And, and then stomach cramp wise, probably five, six hours ruined my day. And, uh, it was the most pain I've ever been in, uh, felt just weak and couldn't do anything. Took all my strength away, all my energy. And, uh, it, it I had the burned pissing, burned going out. That was, that was intense. I've never had anything remotely close to that ever since. So I kind of got thrown to the wolves early on in my chili head experience. Um, that Mad Dog Pepper, though, that chocolate bootleg ghost pepper, hit me probably as hard as anything. As you go back and watch that video, can handle it, the heat part, fine, though. But that, that, was, that was intense. Um, about an hour later, I actually got hit with mild uh, stomach cramps. Where all I had to do, though, was just sit down and for about 30 minutes and it went away and I was totally fine and there was no issues with anything because I feel like my body has gotten used to digesting the hot stuff and it, it hasn't caused any problems. So, and that's what I'm kind of getting ready for that Mad Dog Plutonium. And I know Johnny and, and he's recommended Scoville that throwing up after doing that Plutonium and a lot of people just throw up doing it. So I got like, I have a bucket when I get ready, when I finally do Dude, I just got to find a block of time where I'll be able to just like, if it does get me where I, I, I'm going to be okay. Um, but guys, these were not, these were not, uh, uncomfortable for me. They may be for somebody else that's not used to hot stuff, but again, been doing the fresh peppers. I love the taste of these. And with the ranch, it was, uh, they have kick to them. As you eat them, you get a little bit more heat as you're eating. Like I feel a nice warmth in my in my face right now. You could probably tell a little bit of sweating going on. Definitely a little bit of sweating with that. So, I mean, they do have heat, don't get me wrong. It's just, it, it wasn't intolerable. And uh, I'm giving them two thumbs up. I'm giving these five stars just as far as uh, a spicy chip. It was, uh, and again, being Taco Bell, I didn't think they were gonna put a lot of Reaper to really screw people up. But again, if you don't have hot stuff, I could, I could see this really burning you. Uh, it, it's like those Pocky Ghost Pepper chips. Those were delicious. I really, really liked those as well. But uh, yeah, that's these are the chips here, guys, on that. And I got these on Amazon, I believe. I just ordered them. <clears throat> with that, but, uh, check out my podcast, Conversation with the Big Guy Ryback, available on all podcast platforms if you guys could subscribe. And if you could turn on notifications here and share the channel, guys, you got to turn on notifications, though. YouTube has it now where if you don't, uh, the video's... All of them are all turned off. So I know it sucks on that, but uh, we put out a lot of videos here and uh, we appreciate it. And a lot of people we see though, they don't get the notifications. It is what it is. And, uh, but we're having fun here. And a Feed Me More Nutrition available on feedmemore.com and Amazon. Thank you guys so much for supporting that. You can save 10% with discount code YouTube10. Uh, check that out. We're gonna keep putting out fun videos here in between my, all my work and getting stuff done. Uh, and uh, greatly, greatly appreciate it, guys. Happy New Year. Happy 20, 2020. And uh, until next time, get hungry, stay hungry, feed me more.
Thank you guys very much for watching Ryback TV. If you could smash that subscribe, hit that like button, share this channel, and for Feed Me More Nutrition on feedmemore.com, save 10% with Podcast 10, click here for my podcast conversation with the big guy Ryback, available on all podcast platforms. Click here. And for more videos of yours truly on Ryback TV, click here. Feed me more.